On the occasion of the 16th International Energy Forum Ministerial held in April in New Delhi, India, the International Energy Forum also presented the Jodi Information Seminar. The Jodi Seminar was really for the data users who are using the Jodi data to listen to them, to tell them about the effort we're doing. While the, uh, the, the heads meeting that, that happened before the seminar is really to get further guidance and support from the organization. And I'm extremely pleased with the level of support we are getting from the heads of all the partner organizations. India is a very serious member of IEF and we want uh, to promote this neutral platform which brings together both producers and consumers. Heads of organizations took time to meet in closed session to bring each other up to date, to analyze the latest trends impacting the oil and gas industry and to discuss more effective use of available data. Jodi now is available at industry platforms. That was not the case before. So now you can go to the Bloomberg terminal and see Jodi data, as well as Thompson Reuters coming up and other major data redistribution agencies. This is a major milestone to Jodi. Detailed presentations were delivered at the Jodi seminar from the eight member organizations. Together, they examined stronger transparency, importance of timeliness, and effective application of data. Well, the demand obviously comes from policymakers who have to um, analyze the data and, and, and do their balances and, and see which direction um, their energy sectors are going. And so it's really, really important that they have this accurate data because without it, um, it's, it's impossible to actually do any of the modeling work that needs to be done for these long-term analyses of you know, energy demand, supply stocks, which is very important. Jody has grown in stature and reputation over the years, and key organizational commitment to its success remains essential. OPEC has been one of the founding fathers of uh, Jody and has been steady in supporting Jody, giving Jody all the support that it requires. And I want to say too that OPEC member countries have been very supportive in providing the Jody data on a monthly basis and even doing better than the M-2, which is two month lag that is expected by providing the data for to us much earlier. Jody data is about transparency, it is about completeness, and it is about quality and timeliness of data for the benefit of all. Gathering precise data is an ongoing global exercise as the organization continues to upgrade the data and expand its footprint. Olade is one of the contributing organizations. This kind of meeting, uh, we can share our experiences, we can uh, see uh, how we can implement the best practices, we can promote some kind of coordinated actions in terms of uh, implement, for example, a capacity building initiative in, in different uh, uh, countries and, and sub-regions. So it is important to, to, to have a shared vision of how to move forward and how to improve uh, the data quality and to implement uh, better uh, timeliness and, and sustainability of the initiative, of course. As Jody expands its range and use, more governments, financial services and news organizations are working jointly to deliver the data with continued focus, clarity and timeliness. I mean, the quality of data is the basis of Jody. I mean, you can do all the seminars you want. If you don't have reliable data, quality and timely, nobody is going to come. So our challenge is to continue while we do this political front and the visibility of Jody at the highest level, we should not really lose sight of improving the quality of the data on the ground. And we, uh, we and, the, the internet and the, the different partner organization spend a lot of time doing exactly that. Uh, encouraging the countries to do updates, to do uh, historical revisions, and so that's really a big part of that.